So to do this problem, again, just like we did before, we want to look at our divisor and make sure our live divisor is linear, which in this case, our divisor is linear. So since our divisor is linear, we can just set it equal to 0 and find the 0. So I have 2x minus 1 equals 0. To solve, I have to add 1 on both sides, then divide by 2. Okay, So now I have 1 half. And then I take my coefficients. So I have 2, 3, negative 4, 1, and positive m1. Did everybody see how I didn't need to include zeros? Because I have it in standard form and there's no, there's no missing values. You guys see how that compares to the last problem? First number, as you bring down, is 2. 2 times 1 half is 1. 3 plus 1 is 4. 4 times 1 half is 2. Negative 4 plus 2 is negative 2. Negative 2 times 1 half is negative 1. 1 plus negative 1 is 0. 0 times 1 half is 0. 1 plus 0 is 1. So therefore, again, you have remainder, constant, linear, quadratic, and cubic. So now you write your polynomial, but now we have a remainder. Remember, always write your remainder over your divisor. So the final answer is 2x cubed plus 4x squared minus 2x plus my remainder, because my constant is 0, so I don't need to include that, my remainder over my divisor. Anybody have any questions for that? No questions? Okay. 